proud of our efforts and it's really sweet. It's released, personally. I'm pretty excited about it. <laughs> it's something that we, we finished off, signed off on about two months ago or something, so it's, it's not new. I guess I can't say something. But it's, um, it's good to finally be able to have a record out that we can really say we totally back. capture that the nervous energy of like a, a live performance and that kind of like human element because a lot of the a lot of like modern records that you listen to these days have got a different style of production which is tailored more towards a, a sugary kind of um, perfected sound and we kind of feel that the the real art to to real rock and roll like actually legitimate rock and roll is the imperfection of the human element so we look at it like we try and take a photo of the moment in time that it was when we recorded it and then like for better or worse we don't fuck with it after that. Down on, I thought it was one of our guitar heads, but it was it wasn't one of ours, it was someone else's. And um, this like the English dude just walked over and he's like, "Excuse me, mate." And I'm like, "Yeah, yeah." And he's like, "See where you put your beer down there?" And I'm like, "Yeah." And he goes, "Put your beer down there one more time. I'm gonna cut your fucking head off." <laughs> and I was like, "Yeah, man. No, you won't <laughs> see that beer there again." <laughs> so after this tour, what were you guys doing last year? I think we're gonna put. To finish off this tour without this event, we had a big I don't know. We're going to try and get another record out as soon as we can. She dreams of America, America. Sweet dreams of America, America. Thank you so much for chatting with us. You're welcome. Thank you for chatting with us. <laughs> 